So let's talk about Operation H2O. This is most people's first contact with GCL, so soup's important. Quick rundown, show up for the slot that you signed up for, walk around your assigned dorm area with a cooler full of water bottles and start handing them out to people with a flyer and invite people to things. Try to make sure you're actually signing up for slots. Doing a kind of non-committal, I'll show up whenever I show up to help. It works and it's appreciated, but it might also give your staff a few heart attacks and headaches trying to make sure that the slots are filled when you're gonna show up to do it anyways. So just try to sign up. And try to sign up for as much as you think you can. I know a lot of you have other start of semester things you need to take care of and definitely take care of those things, but the more you can push yourself, the more that can be accomplished. Tip number, what is it, 2B or C? Is when you're handing out water bottles, have an opening tagline. Something simple like, would you like a free water bottle? And if they're like, why yes, I'd love a free water bottle. Or even if they're like, no, I hate water. You can hand them a flyer and say something like, cool, we're with Gator Chris Life and we're having a Dutch clogging event tonight. Or whatever the night event happens to be. Before they run off with the water and flyer, try to get in one more question. And this one's important. Something like, are you looking for a church on campus. You'll find that a lot of people are actually more interested in finding a church on campus than they are interested in water or even Dutch clogging, surprisingly enough. If they seem interested, offer to get their contact info so you can give them more information about the church. Some years we have like a sheet of paper that they can fill out, others we have like a Google form or app or something. Either way, after they fill it out, make sure you add your own personal notes about them immediately afterwards. You're going to be meeting a lot of people this week, so even even if you think you won't, you're probably going to forget a lot of them. Taking notes about what they look like or what they've told you about themselves, like where they're from or their favorite episode of My Little Pony, will help you when you're getting in contact with them later. And that brings me to another thing. These forms are going into a GCL-wide database, so if you feel like you're absolutely unable to follow this person up yourself, then as a backup, they can be assigned to someone in the mystical database land. However, this process of reassigning these people can sometimes take valuable time. Plus, after just this short interaction, you you are now their only friend in the entirety of Gainesville, so it really works best if you are the one to follow them up. And lucky for you, you get first dibs. So make sure you write your name on the form to claim them and take a picture of the form before you turn it in so you can contact your new friend in the afternoon.